First, I would like to address George's um, misunderstand, misunderstanding of my plan, saying that we would colonize space. We're not going to colonize space. We're going to explore space so that we can colonize it in the future. We're not gonna. We're we're still exploring space. So your point about our plan not fulfilling the resolution is bold. Also, you also said that the whatever Copenhagen thingy said that we can't have uh, colonies on planets. Well, we're not having colonies on planets. We're looking for places in space, not on planets, to, look, to put our colonies. Also, Jerry said that. Um, uh, George said that reproduction is impossible in space because of gravity. Well, as we, uh, you said, you saw in my constructive, the O'Neill cylinder and the Stanford torus produce artificial gravity by spinning, producing, inor producing inertia. Also, um, Jerry, Jerry stated that $50 billion for each government were needed to do this 10 list of um, things that are more important in the space. Well, we have plenty of money for that. $89 billion left over from Afghanistan that we did not use for space. That, that can be used to fund all of these things. 89 billion minus 50, that's 40, that's 39, and that's more than enough money for all the things in negative ones. We can do everything. <laughs> yes, do all the things. Yeah. Overall, <laughs> we the affirmative believe that we as a nation, and maybe later as a species, need to expand our knowledge of the cosmos. Now, we can't control what other countries do, but we can take the initiative. With the influx of new money from our evacuation of Afghanistan, we have a whole array of possibilities to pursue. 19 billion of 108 billion saved is a small percentage, but it's still enough to double NASA's budget and fund many more missions. With these missions, we will find resources, preserve the human race, establish a foothold in the stars, and further our knowledge of the cosmos. This newfound opportunity must not be missed. The amount of possibilities is astronomical. We need to explore new ideas. Um, we need to explore new ideas. There's much space for improvement. We envision a new future, a future where science and progress will lead to all men's happiness. And it starts right here, in America, with NASA. We the affirmative say, when life gives you lemons, explore space. Thank you, and vote for us.